So the question is, after someone has been diagnosed with heart failure, can this be treated? Um, and the answer is absolutely yes. And there's uh, two parts of it. First of all, uh, there's inadequate forward flow of blood, which can lead to the heart failure symptoms, shortness of breath, leg swelling, abdominal swelling, abdominal girth, um, weight gain, early satiety. So you want to get rid of that extra fluid. And this is done with using diuretics. Um, these are medications that help to pee out the fluid. Uh, furosemide, torsemide, Bumex are the three biggest ones that we use. There are other ones. Um, one of the things is good kidney function too. So people who are on end stage um, kidney disease, they need to be on dialysis. So that can be very tricky. But getting rid of that extra fluid is going to be the, the best way. And the second part is going to be your salt restriction. You want to have a really, really, really huge salt restriction. Where salt goes, water goes. So with the diuretics, restricting the salt uh, intake and foods that are packed in salt. So also restricting a lot of processed foods. How are you going to know this is working well? Is also checking your weight. You want to make sure that we understand what your dry weight is. And if you start to have increase in weights, then taking an extra water pill to get rid of that extra fluid. And the third one, the most important is figuring out why did this happen? Is it due to a blockage? Is it due to um, uncontrolled hypertension? Is it due to obesity? Treating those risk factors, treating those underlying issues. Is it due to a squeezing function? Uh, possibly due to blockage. So, you know, cardiac catheterization to make sure that these blockages have been taken care of. Or is it due to high blood pressure, treating the blood pressure and treating those other risk factors? Hope this helps.